Hello, we are in Rustboro, which is a autumn island town, and it is by underscore horrible gaming on Instagram. And I just wanted to say that the lighting is very beautiful. It's like a sunset. And I noticed that the flag is also very cute. Hay rides. And the spooky fence with the pumpkin. Um, I've seen this street be before, the street design. Colin Crossing had this, and it is so nice. It's actually his design. Um, I'm not going to change into the any outfit. I mean, let me see. I could wear this, actually. I do like these. Let's go ahead and see how it looks. Oh, cute. Acorn, stockings, business shoes, frugal dress. Yes, okay. Frugal hat. Should I change into a frugal hat? Maybe. Let's just do it. Okay, that is absolutely better than what I had. So, okay, yeah, well, well actually, okay, what will we take? Boba? Let's see. Actually, I'm gonna change into stuff. I love it. So I'm just gonna grab this. I love my little accessories. So thank you for adding that. I actually will change, um, I decided. That hat looks better. So we're in the entrance, and this is Rustboro's map. Very straight, like, edges with the pavements. And we got these villagers. Uh, Biscuit looks very interesting. And that is the map. And this is the entrance. <clears throat> so it has like a little, the road, and then it has the middle piece where you can just sit down. And I love how there's trees. And the trees and the street together. Very nice, there's bikes. And we'll go ahead and go to the right love this arch and here's a little eating area this island looks amazing because like the lighting works with the fall colors so well it makes everything look golden it is very nice and this is super cool and cute leafs flowers cute i love the font that they used for the um, little cart. So that's where Leaf sells his flowers. And a very nice extended cafe area, very big cafe. And so the beaches and the house is not decorated. So yeah, this is a grocery store. Oh my goodness. Yes, it looks like the building's like a kind of historic building with the bricks. That is so cool. I love that. Um, grocery store looks like downtown. Very cute. And there's little vending machines. I love how much road is like everywhere. The road is like stretches all throughout the island. And also there's so many bikes, which is accurate. Oh, I love that. That fence. It looks really realistic. That is actually amazing. So these are little vending machines, like the gate looks so good. The metal gate looks so real. You might need that code. If you guys are going for a city, you need that. Totally need that. And yes, Nora, you do buildings great from the front and also from the side. Like the perspectives are perfect. So walking down the street.
Wow. Great. In all angles. And little seating areas. And there's cute little pumpkins everywhere. And again, that fence literally looks so good. And also, look at my bag. My maple bag looks awesome. Ooh, very cute. Ooh, that's actually so pretty. And we got another building with fountain. And this is another building, yep. Again, very historic. Love the wooden door. And the brick code is really good. And here's a little pier where you can eat. Nice. Rustboro, the name of the island. Rustboro. Ooh. That is a bridge up there. This is like always, I'm transformed into another world. Like it's just crazy, man. It is crazy. Absolutely. Here's a little sitting area. And I was really intrigued by the bridge. Um, that is super cool. And I see a whole little town over there. That is so cool. Super cool. It looks so realistic. I just can't really- I just have no words. Nice bridge. And I love how many pumpkins are here. Little piano area. And look out to the sea. I also really like the fence, the little iron and stone fence. Perfect. Oh, this is so cute. Used books. Oh my goodness. Yes, Bl Blathers books. Very cute. It looks very wood tones, very brown, vintage, like old books. Perfect for blathers. And here's a little cafe. And look at the neon sign. And the neon sign code. Like it looks like neon too. Very, very, very cool. So here's a little cafe. Very nice. I love how you can just walk and see all the shops. And I also am in love with the leaf pile. I want to put it everywhere. Um, since I'm going for cottage core, I'm gonna. Well, I want to put like the the green leaf pile everywhere because it just looks so cool and i love walking on it this is super cool little the street walking down the street oh big building like how there's i like how there's things up there like on the second level Oh my gosh, I love my outfit so much. I'm gonna have to change um, to this outfit like permanently. Like I'm gonna get my frugal hat and I need a maple leaf po pochette. Um, definitely. And there is like a little canals 
over here with bridges. There's one bridge, yep, canal. And there's a house. Ooh. I love that. I love how the they connected the two houses and then they made it like a huge building. Ooh, they connected three houses. Yes, three houses. So this is one building. Wow, I love that. That's so cool. I just love the, the color and then the little awning. So that's another building. And then there's this one, which is brown and green. I love that idea of just connecting the buildings with the houses. Yes, it just gives it more dimension. And there's another building. A lot of different codes. And I love how each building is different with a different color scheme. And then here's a little canal with the bushes and the fence together. So it looks like landscaping. Um, I would honestly like to suggest a nice business idea for Horrible Gaming. She could definitely be an architect. Does anyone else agree? Please tell me in the comments because I for sure believe that she could excel in architecture. Come on. Like designing, building, and layouts. Like that is just... Like this game is honestly... Like yes, you're designing. And if you are good at the game... You're good at designing real cities, probably. Because, look at this. Very realistic. And, yes. So there's two houses here. And also, my mom plays because she likes the game. And because it it's like... Um, she wanted to be an architect when she grew up so this kind of like makes her design cities and stuff so she really likes that this is definitely a school yep little university or school Ooh. Oh, this is a train. That looks really good. Two little trains going. Wow, and there is a code for a little tunnel. That is really nice. And there's this house. So, yeah, you can actually see that little train tunnel. And again, very easy to navigate the island, very easy to walk around, not get lost. I really admire the perfect cities, like... And honestly, this isn't a very perfect city, it's very realistic and cluttered in a good way. I admire the city islands because it's just, you just follow the road. And it's very easy to go walk around the city islands. So here is Nook's Cranny. And I like how this is like connected with Able Sisters with a fountain in the middle. So this is Able Sisters. And it's true, benches are everywhere. I feel like that's the most important thing of a city. Benches are really everywhere. And this is a the Roost Cafe. Okay, I'm actually very excited for this. Hopefully we get a real building for Brewster. I'm hoping for that. But this looks good. And hopefully Horrible Gaming is as excited that there's going to be a real Brewster Cafe. 
they just announced it and I am very excited. Me and my mom are very excited. So I guess that is coming in October. Not sure what the date is. I'm gonna have to find out. And this is the entrance. Have we seen everything? We went to the right first. And... This is up. And we did see this building. I'm wondering if we saw everything. Okay, we have seen this. And this is the entrance. So yeah, we ended off with Brewster's Cafe. Sorry, Maple. All right, so we actually have seen everything. This island was perfection on, I don't know why I said it like that. It was perfection, I loved it. And the beaches aren't decorated. And we are matching with our hats. Yes, oh my goodness. Uh, I love this costume. It's a scarecrow and I'm literally planning on being a scarecrow for Halloween. I'm not even kidding. I'm gonna be a, a scarecrow for Halloween. Um, love your outfit. I need that, honestly. I need to be a scarecrow. I need to dress up in the game. Um, yeah, so I am planning to be a scarecrow in, on Halloween in real life. So yeah, I'm excited for that. I'm gonna wear some overalls. And let's just sit and enjoy my boba. Oh, sit down and enjoy and then let's end off the tour of this beautiful island i absolutely loved rustboro it was amazing tell me your favorite part in the comments and i will see you guys in another video and this island is by underscore horrible gaming on instagram thank you guys so much for watching i will see you guys in another video goodbye